Symptoms of a bad flywheel. Knowing the warning symptoms of a bad flywheel will enable you to replace it as soon as possible with a new or used flywheel and keep you safe while driving. The flywheel of an automobile is a vital part that keeps it operating properly. If it isn't functioning correctly, the automobile won't operate well or might simply not run at all. Welcome to our video on, Symptoms of a Bad Flywheel. If you've ever encountered issues with your vehicle's flywheel, you're in the right place. We'll dive into what a flywheel is, its symptoms, and most importantly, if you can drive. What is a flywheel? A rotating disc known as a flywheel aids in energy storage. It accomplishes this by rotating on its axis. The more energy it accumulates, the quicker it spins. Then, this power can be released to drive machinery like electric motors or turbines. There are several uses for flywheels, including in motor vehicles, wind turbines, and the production of electric power. Symptoms of a bad flywheel 1. Slipping gears There are a number of potential causes of gear slippage, but one of the most common is a faulty flywheel. When the flywheel is malfunctioning, it is unable to produce the required torque to prevent the gears from slipping. Wear and tear, damage, or even a flaw in the flywheel itself are some of the potential causes of this. 2. Difficulty changing gears. Gear shifting issues may be caused by a damaged flywheel. The gears may shift irregularly if the flywheel isn't functioning correctly. There are a number of possible causes for why shifting gears could be challenging with a damaged flywheel. 3. Burning smell. An indication that your clutch isn't operating properly or isn't being used appropriately is a burning smell coming from underneath your car. It results from clutch plate wear and tear which may be brought on by a deformed flywheel that generates excessive heat and friction. 4. Vibrating Clutch Pedal There can be an issue with the flywheel if your clutch pedal is vibrating. There are a number of plausible explanations for why a faulty flywheel generates a vibrating clutch pedal. One possibility is that the engine vibrations brought on by the bent flywheel are causing the clutch pedal to vibrate. Before we explore further, do us a quick favor. Hit that subscribe button and stay connected for more automotive insights. Now, let's continue. 5. Clutch Drag The clutch may drag if there is too much inertia in the flywheel. The flywheel tries to continue spinning at its pre-acceleration speed as the engine and vehicle accelerate. The entire system will drag if the clutch tries to seize the flywheel too rapidly and it resists. 6. Difficulty in starting a car Because it might stop the engine from turning over, a damaged flywheel can contribute to starting issues. This frequently results from a seized flywheel, which won't turn even when the engine is started. The starter motor may experience issues as well. 7. Engine Stalls A rotating part of the engine called the flywheel stores energy and aids in a smooth startup. The engine may stall and idle unevenly as a result of a damaged flywheel. So, can one drive with a bad flywheel? Although it is technically feasible to drive with a damaged flywheel, we don't advise it. Any flaws can have a big knock-on effect elsewhere, especially within the clutch components, the crankshaft, and the engine, thanks to the crucial role that your flywheel plays in ensuring a smooth transfer of power from your engine to your wheels. In conclusion, this video has provided an overview of the what a flywheel is, its symptoms, and most importantly, if you can drive when it is bad. With this knowledge, drivers can confidently address flywheel issues and avoid driving with them. If you find this video useful, please recommend it to your friends, subscribe to our channel for more automotive advice, and leave us feedback so we can continue to improve. Thank you for watching.